Hey there, tennis fans. I'm Grace Carter, and this is Tennis Now, presented by Tennis Express. Tennis Express, order today and it ships today. Well, tough times for Boris Becker. Former world number one and his wife Lily split last month after nine years of marriage and 13 years together. The couple says the split is amicable. They share a son whose name is Amadeus. In an interview with the Daily Mail published earlier this year, Lily Becker said they tried counseling to save the marriage, but ultimately the disconnect was just too great. Now she's conceded she turned to vodka and cigarettes while Boris was coping with the stress of financial issues. She says she's had a rough year. At first she let go completely in every way. Too much drinking, too much smoking, too much going out and just not caring. She said she thought her life sucks and that she was going to die. This is all according to the Daily Mail. She says she turned to vodka, was smoking a pack of cigarettes a day, that Boris was going through a bad time in his way, so he didn't seem to notice, and they just went their own ways. Well, this month, some of Boris's treasured trophies and tennis memorabilia are up for auction. A total of 81 items are going to be sold by British auction house Wiles & Hardy & Company to raise funds for Becker's creditors. A full-sized replica of Boris's 1989 U.S. Open trophy is among the silverware in that sale. Now, Becker coached Novak Djokovic to six of his 12 Grand Slam titles before the pair ended their three-year partnership. A special edition Seiko watch that Noli gave Boris is also on the auction list, as is one of Boris's championship Puma rackets. A treasured trophy sure to gain a lot of attention is Boris's 1988 Davis Cup championship, he won with the German team. Boris Becker was declared bankrupt in London last year. He reportedly owes a private British banking firm about $4.2 million, is also facing a $40 million lawsuit filed by a former business partner. Now, if you're in London, you can see the entire Boris Becker auction collection at a public viewing coming up on June 20th. That's at the Knapp Gallery, Regent's Park. You can bid on any of the items online. Simply go to wileshardy.com. Only debit cards, no credit cards are accepted. Bidding closes on June 28th. In his career, Boris earned more than $25 million. He won six Grand Slam titles. So where did it all go? Well, some to bad business investments, a Dubai development project that went bust, a paternity suit, a tax evasion fine, and divorce settlements all have cost the German legend dearly. In his autobiography, The Player, Becker also revealed he battled an addiction to alcohol and sleeping pills at one point during his career and fell into depression after the death of his beloved father. It's been a tough time for Boris, one of the game's most dynamic champions. Boris remains an important voice in the game of tennis. He served as a Roland Garros analyst for Eurosport and is a longtime Wimbledon commentator for the BBC. Here's hoping for better things in Boris's future. And that wraps it up for this time. I'm Grace Carter. We'll see you next time here on Tennis Now.